Hello. Today is a great day to be alive because today is Limerick Day. Limericks are absolutely the best poem in the world. They started over in Limerick, Ireland. Many say they were created by a man named Edward Lear. Lies. He didn't create it. He just shared his Limerick talent with the world. But before we talk about Limericks, we can also celebrate Nutty Fudge Day because today is all about nuts in fudge. Nutty fudge. But first, I want you all to listen. I'm going to tell you something now that's never been discussed ever since this coronavirus season began. Not once. Not once. But this is late breaking that no one knows but me. And why? Because I thought of it in my brain. Prepare to be amazed. Like literally, this is a match trick. Like Penn and Teller should be calling me to steal this trick. And I'm giving it to you people for free. Here we go. Coronavirus is the acronym CV in the world of education and teaching children how to read. C is a consonant. V, vowel, right? So you're probably thinking, all right, what are you talking about? Okay, listen to this. The word coronavirus. Every other letter goes consonant, vowel, consonant, vowel, consonant, vowel. C, O, R, O, N, A, V, I, R, U, S. All these consonants, all of these vowels. C, V, coronavirus, consonant, vowel. Whew. Amazing. I bet you never knew that until today. And I hope you share this with all your friends. And maybe, just maybe, you could share it with them through a limerick. So I'm going to create some limericks for all of you today. I just want the audience to shout out to me different limerick words you want to say. What's that? You got it. I heard the first word, coronavirus. Let's do it. The coronavirus surely sucks. Many of us say, oh shucks. We watch the news and want to know what it's going to be done. This sure as heck is not a lot of fun. I hate it. My phone autocorrects to the word ducks. There you go. Coronavirus limerick. Let's do another one. One more. What did I say? Sure. Let's talk about my day. Okay, my day today. Let's do this. Let's do this. Got it. I woke up today, brushed my hair with a comb, because now I teach from home. I stared at the screen. For lunch, I ate ground beef. It was lean. Then I went for a walk. I roam. Wow, I'm really good at this. Like I'm. I wish limericks could be like full time job. I'm a really good limericker. Limericker, -er. limericker maker. Whatever it is, that's what I do. One more. Let's do one more. Let's do one more. Something about uh, TV. Good one. I love to watch myself TV. That makes no sense. I like to watch a lot of TV. Right now, all I see is Fauci. Some people get really, really mad. Others get really, really sad. Oscar isn't the only one who's grouchy. I'm so, I'm, but I'm, I'm just blown away how good I am at this. Like, this is just, I'm actually born to do this. I'm like literally amazing. Let's do one more. And I have homework for all of you. Last one is called homework for all of you. It goes like this. I have homework for all of you. This is exactly what you're going to do. You can all give it a try. All the girls and all the guys. Whoever writes the best limerick will be announced tomorrow night on the news. There you go. So I hope you all tonight make some limericks. If you could think of a limerick, you could add it in the comment section below, and I will announce the winner of the limerick tomorrow on the show. So thank you so much for tuning in. This is really great seeing you all, and I will see you all tomorrow on May 13th. Bye, everybody.